So I found a good old blast from the past, uh, which I have not seen before. But uh, it's funny how two people who I only just now am starting to really, uh, uh, you know, get familiar with, Haley Williams and Robert Pattinson, they uh, interviewed each other. And uh, I am... And it's funny how this relates to my life now because I'm prepared, I am hyped for Robert Pattinson in the Batman and I am, and I recently, a few months ago, became a fan of Haley Williams. So let's see what this was like back in the old days. And I say old days, uh, in 2008, here we go. Wait, 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 yeah, hold up, hold up, hold up. MySpace. It's fucking MySpace. Wow, this is, uh... You know what's funny? I never had a MySpace account. But I know of MySpace, and, uh... I remember about it, and I'm pretty sure that, um... A good chunk of you uh, young folks that may or may not be watching this probably don't even know what my space is. <laughs> Alrighty. Oh, this was before it came out. What's going on? This is Haley Williams from Paramore. I'm hanging out with Robert Pattinson. And you're watching my space's Artist on Artist. We're going to talk about the Twilight film, so... Thanks for hanging out with us. How did you get involved with this movie? <laughs> I was just messing around in London. Yeah. I was doing music last year. I was going to give up acting, and then. Wow. And then you know, guess the end of the year, and you got no money. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so yeah, I, I guess I'll do this audition. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be bothered with it, but you did it anyways. That's um, it. How did you get involved with it? Um, I read the books, and I really loved them. And uh, someone, someone told me they were making the films, and I just was really psyched about it. I mean, I'm, I love movies, and I especially love film adaptations of books, so I try, I mean, we wrote the song, Josh had this cool music, and I thought it, it fit the vibe of the, the tone of the story, and we just kind of chased after it. We were, like, knocking on doors, calling <laughs> anyone we could, and um, we got lucky. I, I didn't think it was going to work. I, I had heard that we should just give up, and that we should you know, we weren't going to be in the film. And Did someone tell you that? Yeah. You should I, just I, give up, right? Yeah, you should just, look. <laughs> it's not going to happen. Not, we're not going to get in this movie. And I was like, yeah, we are. That's good. Yeah. It really fits Thank with you. the film. Thanks a lot. Where are you from? I'm from Nashville, Tennessee. That's, that's where me and all the guys are from. We met there and started the band. So I was wondering what your accent was, because I like the way you say here. Here? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here? Here? <laughs> well, I'm from London, so I'm gonna say here. <laughs> no, I like it. That's the best part of the song. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> here. I'm gonna have to pay attention to that. I won't no, change so it though, because I know, because I know that you like it now. No, I did you. I, I was trying to. I, it's the first thing that's inspired me to write a song in ages. Really? <laughs> I'm writing this song called Here. <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing. Do you, do you get on MySpace with the whole Twilight thing? Um, I had a MySpace. I really enjoy like talking to fans. We used to talk to our fans through MySpace when we first when we first started, and we had like three fans. We were like counting. Oh yeah, I'm old. I'm old. I remember back uh, twelve years ago. That was all the rage. You know, bands would go on MySpace, try to get famous that way, and and the fact that in the beginning of the video it said Paramore has almost a million fans on uh, on uh, MySpace, yeah. This brings me back to a time when life was much, 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 much fucking simpler. Individual friend requests and getting uh -huh. psyched about it. I mean, like, they were caught on to the whole Twilight thing a long time ago, and, and that's part of the reason we were we got so into it is because of our fans. I love horror films. You should do a horror film for me. 
<clears throat> I can't. I'm not. Like, I'm not good at doing the stuff. Like you, you know, what's fucking funny. I know that this is like a video for MySpace, and it's being recorded, but it just it feels like I'm like invading on two people's privacy right now. It feels like I should not be listening to this. <laughs> As I was trying to explain to my manager about that, like, I was like, you know, I'm not good at this stuff when you're like, you know, when someone's coming up behind you and you've got to like look scared. And he's like, what, acting? <laughs> but, but yeah, I can't do it. I can't do that. <laughs> That's awesome. So yeah, all these like thrillers and stuff. I, I don't know, I don't know how to do like a scared face. Right. I don't know how to do any, I don't know what any facial expressions are supposed to mean. Yeah. Like, it's like, this is like the weird thing in Twilight. There were so many looks because I had contact lenses in as well. Right, so yeah. you can't like feel like what your look is. Yeah. And then like, <laughs> what like why are you looking at you want to kill her? Like what are you, what are you doing? And I'm like, I'm not <laughs> that's how it looks. Even back then they knew that he knew the movie was stupid. The people I love. <laughs> oh my god. So that must be insane for you because I mean like <clears throat> Before this, before all this, you could probably walk around and you know have a cheeseburger or a, a garden burger even, and garden burger. Garden burger, like a veggie burger. Ugh. You don't like veggie burgers? Well, okay. This is 2008. Veggie burgers were not around, or at least if they were, they weren't as popular, nearly as popular as they are now. With this damn, uh, they call it the. Uh, the Beyond Whopper and shit like that. I'm calling it a garden burger. Yeah, that sounds a bit. It's like I found this in the garden. <laughs> let's just not. Let's just have a cheeseburger then. Okay. All right. So you could go. You could probably walk around, do your thing, and and I'm sure people would come up to you, talk to you, want a picture, but it can't be anything like it is now, right? Yeah, it's weird. Cause I mean, I'm. Stuck. Yeah, it feels weird to say this, but they were. They were just fucking babies here. And it's and I say it's weird for me to say that because I mean shit, they're older than me. Eh. <laughs> shit, in 2008 I was 14. <sighs> yeah. What I uh Oh man, if I knew then what I know now, Jesus. My whole life like thinking a very paranoid person. I think everyone's looking at me, even when they're not, even since I was a little kid. Oh my god. Um, and then when people come up to me, it's like, you know, it's just proof. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, see, they're always they looking at me. They were looking at me the whole time. That's amazing. I mean, um, there's times that I feel really awkward. People come up and they'll be like, are you Haley from Paramore? And I'm like, no, but I get that all the time. Trust me, she has me. Her teeth are way worse than mine. It's always like I'm dissing myself and they're like, oh, okay, and they walk away. But then I feel bad about it. Like, I don't know what's worse to like endure the awkwardness or just make them feel bad and have them walk away and then I feel guilty about it. <laughs> so what are you um, what are you trying to do next? Are you trying to lay low? Nah, he did no, he didn't lay low. He just did a shitload of sequels. You know, made him a lot of money. And then got rid and then hit under the radar and did great movie after great movie afterwards have not seen a bunch of other movies he did but I, d I do need to watch the lighthouse though I heard that is really good um I kind of want to do some music I don't know that would be awesome yeah let's do it dude I'm down <laughs> I love singing I'll sing with anyone but I would love to sing with you I, I've actually never heard your voice though right. I would love to do you have, do you have do you have stuff online or anything uh not really I mean no. <laughs> I used to play all the time in LA, but now it's oh, like, really? now I just look like jackass. Just See, it's on. just, it feels so weird. Uh, seriously, like, it feels like I've got, uh, it feels, you know what this feels like? This feels like I'm an FBI or a NSA agent, like, doing surveillance on two people on a date. Like, it, like this, It's all, it almost feels... Weird, but I think that just says more about me than it does about this video. I am the guy. I'm that guy. I'm gonna play I sing too. <laughs> <laughs> Does 
ADHD syndrome. <laughs> Dude, I, I mean, yeah, that that would be cool to see you do some music. It's weird, and now I mean, and now that you've done one movie, mm -hmm. like it's literally you just do one movie and then you're just done. That's it. <laughs> it's like yeah. defined. And it's like, yeah. <laughs> you see, wait like five years. It's like I always did, like I, like, I always get referred to as an ex model and oh. stuff, and like I maybe did three <laughs> jobs by accident. Wow. I did like woman's ring modeling. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ex model. It's just your hand, and they're like, that's that's Rob. I know. So I used to do it in catalogs. Wow, that's amazing. They had very ha feminine hands. I still do. Wow, I don't I don't see you as having feminine hands. Maybe nice hands, but I mean, look at that. That's not really necessarily a feminine hand, I would say either. But yeah, I mean, if I had that hand, it would look a little bit weird. <laughs> I think. Yeah, probably. I'm Robert Pattinson. This is Haley Williams. You're watching MySpace Artists on Artists. I check out Twilight on November 21st. Thanks. Oh wow, that's wow. Uh, I think I was grinning ear to ear during that whole fucking video because all it does is just, it takes me back to 2008. Simpler time in my life when, you know, parents take care of you. Don't have to worry about bills. Don't have to worry about any of that stuff. Yeah. Oh, God damn, I'm starting to feel really fucking sad. All right, uh, let's, uh, I need to, uh, I, uh, yeah, fuck this. I'm, I'm going to, uh, I'm not going to, I should stop feeling like that. <clears throat> it's dangerous. All right. Uh, yeah. Because then you, because it's like, you know, because I've done some, Watched a bunch of interviews with Haley throughout the years, and, uh, excuse me, you can see her, um, you can tell that, uh, you know, she, uh, struggles a lot with depression, and, uh, I think you can probably tell, you know, one reason why I love her so much is... She, uh, you know, is such an amazing artist and, uh, and, you know, powers through the depression, you know, and, uh, and I think that, and, you know, uh, have a lot of respect for that. Yeah. Cause I can relate a lot because I have major depressive disorder and, uh, Trust me, that shit is not fun. Okay, bye-bye.